eleven dollars and thirty six cents. I want you to justify to your partner that my place value chart represents eleven dollars and thirty six cents. Turn and talk. Okay, give me a thumbs up if you agree or you can show me disagreement. Thumbs up if you agree or you can show me disagreement. Does this represent $11.36? Okay, I'm seeing some agreement. What do I need to divide by? Yes? I need to divide by four. Here's one equal group, two equal groups, three equal groups, four equal groups. One, two, three, four equal groups. What do you recommend? Turn and talk. How are we going to divide that by four? Mm, you're remembering something. Okay, where is Samantha? How about Marco? Where's Marco? Go ahead. Yeah, so it is going to be hard to divide this into four places because there's only one of them, right? It is going to be hard. So I can see why he's talking about decomposing it. I want you to talk again with a partner. Thank you so much, Marco. I want you to talk again with a partner. How, what am I going to need to do to decompose this? Okay, bring that back. I, it is going to be challenging to do that. Where's Jacqueline? Go ahead. What do you think? Okay, we're going to talk again. How are we going to decompose that number? Okay, let's bring that back. I want to share this 10 into my four equal groups. Jacqueline, what do I need to do? Yes, and when I move my 10, how many do I have? I did have one 10, but one 10 is the same as how many ones? Say it together. 10, Ten ones. Okay, here it comes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh oh. Do I still have eleven dollars thirty six cents or did my number change? Some are saying it changed. I don't have eleven dollars thirty six cents anymore? Yes. Oh I do? No. Oh I don't? Yes. Oh, I do. Yes. You're going to have to prove that to me because I'm so confused right now. Do I still have $11.36? Yes. Who's going to justify that for me? Who's going to justify that for me? Angel, what do you think? I think There's still 11 there, right? Mm -hmm. 
Phew, okay, now let's do the division. I have 11 ones. I'm gonna split them up into my four groups. Help me count, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, stop there. Do I have enough to keep going? No. no. How many did I use? Eight. I used eight. What do I do with these three ones? Because I don't have enough for my four equal groups. What do I do with those three ones? Oh, look, I just gave you a hint. Whoosh. What do I do with those three ones? Tell your partner. <laughs> What do I do with those three ones? Yeah, and how many will I need? Ten for each. Yeah, ten for each. Okay, what do I do with those three ones? Let's hear from James. Yes. How many dots will I need? Ten for each. Yeah. Okay, let's do the first one. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Am I done? No. Let's do the next one. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Am I done? No. Let's do the next one. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh my goodness, there's a lot of tenths, a lot of dimes that my four friends are sharing equally. How will I do that sharing? What should I do now with all of these 33 tenths? Where's Brandon, Brandon Walker. What should I do with these 33? Brandon Williams, I'm so sorry. Forgive me. What do I do with these 33 tenths? Yeah, I'm going to do the sharing. Let's count them together. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. What's up? Seventeen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Twenty. Twenty. Hang on. I want to try to keep my work organized. So I've done twenty so far. Can I keep going? Yes. Twenty-one. Stop. I got to 28. Can I keep going? How many did I have? I got to 28. I think one more time, right? Okay, I got to 28. 29, 30, 31, 32. Ooh. How many did I not get to use yet? One. One tenth. So I used every tenth except for this sad, lonely tenth. What should I do with it? What should I do with it? Brandon, what do you think? Yeah, how will I do that? Absolutely. Okay, here it comes. Count with me. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, we're almost there. Um, Brandon Ortiz, what do you suggest? I have all these hundredths now. What should I do? Turn and talk. What am I going to do with all those hundredths? We're doing the sharing. So we have our four friends, and there are, looks like, 16 hundredths. So what am I going to do with those 16 hundredths? Yeah. Okay, bring it back. Brandon's going to tell me what I need to do next. Go ahead.
How many dots do I have to share? Yeah, 16 dots. Each one represents one hundredth, so 16 hundredths. And how many friends am I sharing with? Do you remember how many friends in our problem? Yeah. Okay, let's count them together. Ready? Count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Woo! You gotta pay attention to to how far you need to go. We had sixteen. Oh dear. What did we do? And how did that help us solve the problem? What did we do and how did that help us solve the problem? Some of you want to share your ideas. Share them first with a partner. I have another page with some other problems, but I can wrap it up right here. What do you pick? Yeah, that was the idea. Okay. Okay. Who will speak to me? What did we what did we just do and how did it help us solve our problem? Joanna? We did divide. We showed the division with a place value chart. Alexis? That's how much you had on the division problem. How much did we have on the division problem? Two dollars and eighty-four cents. Two dollars and eighty-four cents. Are you telling me that you can see two dollars and eighty-four cents somewhere in this place value chart? Yes. yes. Oh, I need to know about that. Jennifer. You can see them like in um, the place value chart because if you just um, count how much um, are in. Oh, tell me more. Do you want to invite someone else into our conversation? What she means is by you're going to count how many are in one box and then you're going to put the number down to, uh, to see the ends that you divide. Help me do that. So there's one, there's two discs in the box, so you put down the two and then you bring down your decimal. And then in one box, on the second box, uh, there's eight, so you put down the eight. And then in the last box, there's four, so you put down the four. Oh. So $3.84. Oh, that is way cool.